Remove the dust cover from the microscope. Clean the lenses as necessary with clean, dry lens tissue. Do not use ordinary facial tissues on the lenses. These can scratch the soft surface of the glass. Use lens tissue as necessary to remove dust from the light source. Avoid touching any lens or mirror with your fingers. Sanitize your hands and put on disposable gloves. You will need a urine or centrifuge tube with a pointed end so that solid material will be concentrated in a small area. Write the patient's name and the date on the tube with felt tip marker. Open the urine specimen and pour some of the well-mixed urine into a centrifuge tube or urine tube. Fill the other urine tube in the same level with water and place a cap on each tube. Place the urine tubes directly opposite to each other in the urine centrifuge. This will balance the centrifuge. Close the lid of the centrifuge and set the timer for five minutes. Turn it on. It will start and stop automatically. Turn on the power switch of the microscope light source and make sure the microscope low power objective, the shortest one, is in place. When the centrifuge has stopped, open the cover, remove the urine test tube without shaking it. Remember to be careful not to shake the test tube during this part of the procedure since you will be drawing a sample of the separated sediment at the bottom. Push the urine pipette into the tube as far as it will go and pour off the urine above the wide part of the pipette. You may also use a transfer pipette to suction off the liquid above the sediment, the supernatant fluid and discard it until there is about one milliliter left in the bottom of the tube. Mix the sediment with the remaining urine by suctioning up and down with the transfer pipette. Note that a sink used to discard urine is considered dirty and should not be used for hand washing. Place a microscope slide on the paper towel and prepare a cover slip. Dispense one drop of the mixed urine sediment onto the center of the slide using the pipette. Pick up the cover slip, touch one edge to the urine drop, and carefully lower it over the drop so there are no air bubbles under it. Place the slide between the spring clamps of the microscope slide holder so that the center of the specimen is positioned over the opening in the stage. Make sure the light source is on and the condenser is lowered with the diaphragm closed. Focus the low power objective using the coarse adjustment knob and then the fine adjustment knob. Inform the physician that the specimen is ready for viewing. After the physician has looked at the slide, remove the slide and discard it in a rigid biohazard sharps container. It could pose a cutting hazard. Clean the enameled surfaces of the microscope as necessary with soap and water. Wipe the stage with gauze or tissue. Be sure the low power objective is in place. Clean the lens with lens paper.
put the dust cover on the microscope and return it to storage.